Reporting to you live here, catching my first ever tropical sunrise on the beaches of Riviera Cancun in Mexico. It's live from last week, episode 152. Let's go! Welcome, my fellow jaywalkers, to another episode of Live from Last Week. Hope last week has served you well. Just a quick shameless plug before we go on. I want you guys to like and share this video and subscribe to the channel. So yesterday was our first full day here in Riviera Cancun for our 2023 vacation trip. Where I woke up to finally get a decent night's sleep the previous night, only to have the luck that I have whenever I go on a tropical vacation. Trying to catch sunrises all over the world with it being cloudy yesterday morning causing me to miss the sunrise but what i was actually able to do yesterday morning was catch the morning sunrise yoga class reminding me once again just how flexible i am before going up to the tennis courts here to do for the first time on a resort since i was in cuba last year as well as doing for the first time in several months and making friends with another resort guest here from England. Yo, Connor from Wimbledon. <laughs> Yo, it's nice playing with you, man, <laughs> from London. Playing them in a set of tennis at this resort. Obviously, England got the win again. <laughs> Good games, man. Played, mate. Ooh. And after that great exercise session, let's proceed to see just how the rest of our Monday went. And guys, did I mention that yesterday was the first experience that the wife and I had ordering in some room service. Wow. How do you like your first time doing room service? Good. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Cheers to room service. Ah, champagne. We had also wrapped up the night with an in-suite jacuzzi session where we had issues trying to figure out how to drain the tub resulting in me doing this workout right before we went to bed last night. Now on to the events of today, Tuesday, where I was lucky again to catch yet another tropical cloud-covered sunrise. I hit up an indoor morning yoga session at the gym since obviously it was raining outside whereas you guys can see I was still unflexible but was happy to find my favorite yoga position. Anyways after editing some live from last week footage yesterday all day while in bed in our own special version of how we like to relax and enjoy this vacation in these unfortunately windy and stormy conditions here is what we were up to today.
Duave got this baby filled up with pina colada. Let's go, Bubba. <laughs> Oh yeah, oh man, so strong, muy fuerte. <laughs> so today, after getting a semi-decent sleep in, I woke up to see if third time's a charm to catch the sunrise. But surprise, surprise, guess who still hasn't caught a tropical sunrise here? So I got up to do another morning yoga class that they offer here at the resort. Get a small breakfast here at the hideaway reception area that I pretty much had to myself. Then checked out this baby at the gym that I've only seen professional athletes use. Trying it out for the first time in my life. And I can officially say, after only 10 minutes on this thing, I was gassed. I also had tried out this kickboxing class that they offered here. Getting a pretty good sweat in which had also reminded me of just how out of shape I actually am. Anyways, after searching for the wife near and far, finding her roaming around on this beautiful day, we went out to have breakfast for a little bit before walking the beautiful beaches in the area. Obviously, as you guys can see here, delivering packages like this to nearby resorts, seeing some Mexican wildlife here in the swamps in person, and getting ready to attend one of our friend's destination weddings here. But before we get on to today's festivities, we have a quick birthday shout out to one of my childhood friends who I'm remembering from elementary school all the way through high school. This birthday shout out goes out to you, Nostrin. Happy birthday, Jason. We also got a birthday shout out to one of my university friends who I remember in nursing school from my days at university. This birthday shout out goes out to you, honey. Happy birthday, honey. And last but not least, we got a birthday greeting to one of my friends who you guys remember has made several Live From Last Week cameos in the past. And whenever I'm here in Mexico, I remember saying Auto Policia. This birthday shout out goes out to you, Cammy. Happy birthday, Cam Sue. I'm hoping that all my friends that have their birthdays today are doing well, staying safe and healthy at this time, and had a great celebration for your birthdays this year. But anyways, now on to the main reason why we made this trip to Mexico, which is to party it up attending the destination wedding of our good friend, Josie.
with an amazing time at Josie's wedding here at the Dreams Natura Resort and Spa last night in Riviera Cancun. Celebrating the union of this newly wedded couple, we also got this teasing glare from one of the bridesmaids that was walking down the aisle, of whom was actually my coworker Nat. I actually messaged earlier this week telling her to enjoy her vacation as I pretended that I couldn't make this wedding. But by these videos, you guys definitely know that we had lots of fun last night. But on to today where I got up early after less than six hours of sleep to try and catch my first ever tropical sunrise with the beaches empty this morning. And after thinking that the clouds in the horizon would spoil yet another opportunity for me to catch my first ever sunrise here, after 10 minutes of waiting, I think I got exactly what I traveled all the way here for. Oh my gosh, guys, even though there's a little bit of cloud cover, I have finally caught my tropical sunrise. Afterwards, going to my daily resort sunrise yoga classes here, working on my non-existent flexibility, the wife and I decided to order room service once again, but this time for breakfast. So while we waited for our order to arrive, I went down to the gym to catch what was probably my favorite class here at the resort, the Zumba fitness class of which I promised the instructor I would leave a quality review for her on TripAdvisor in the near future. Yeah, yeah. with you. Together. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay, oh, uno momento. Okay. If you're ever here at the Royalton, where are we? Royalton Riviera Royal Cancun. Riviera. If you're ever here at the Royalton Riviera Cancun, you gotta take this Zumba class with Astrid. <laughs> the best class you can ever take here. <laughs> But yeah guys, once I returned to the room, our breakfast room service was ready for us to devour and have our patented breakfast in bed just because we can. Anyways, now back in the beach and actually in the water after both pool and cabana hopping earlier, here's a quick video summary of what we had in store for our last full day here on our Mexico trip. So while chilling on the beach in the evening last night, we got to run into these strangers who kinda, sorta, looked familiar. Alright, you wanna hold this? Maybe you got, yeah. And yeah, that's why I can hold it. Ready? One, two, three, cheers! Clink! Okay. <laughs> Next, when we got back to the room, I got to finally do what I've done several times in the past. Getting my Ric Flair strut on with the bathrobe, then drawing up a nice bubble bath and popping a bottle of sparkling wine that they gave us when we first arrived to the resort. Woo! Yay! And after cheersing with the wife to this mini fun-filled vacation... Cheers! Happy anniversary slash birthday slash birthday! Just like previous times I had in a jacuzzi with a bottle of sparkling wine, I got to enjoy this luxurious bubbly saying this one's for me and this one's for my homies. 
But while we're on the topic of bubbly and celebrations, we got a quick belated birthday shout out to one of my classmates from university. This birthday shout out goes out to you, Dennis. Happy belated birthday, Dennis. We've also got a birthday shout out to one of my snowboarding friends out there who you guys remember I went with to Blue Mountain a couple seasons ago. This birthday shout out goes out to you, Philip. Happy birthday, Philip. We next got a birthday shout out to one of my World Youth Day friends who I traveled with to Europe back in 2011. This birthday greeting goes out to you, Charlene. Happy birthday, Charlene. As well, while getting an anniversary cupcake from the Cancun airport, I have an 18th anniversary slash birthday greeting to Sunwing. Happy anniversary, Sunwing. I'm hoping that all my friends that have their birthdays today are doing well, staying safe and healthy at this time, and had a great celebration for your birthdays this year. But now to earlier today, waking up after the body clock got almost exactly six hours asleep, I woke up the wife so that we both could catch the beautiful Cancun sunrise together. And after pretending I was doing a nice morning training run on the beach with my robe on, we were able to make these new core memories together on the beach on our last morning here in Cancun. And just before we went to get these amazing and delicious dishes for breakfast, we had found some wild animal tracks just outside our resort room door, got our last taste of cones of gelato for our trip, said goodbye to our resort room and this beautiful view, and had this farewell from the beach. Bye, Mexico. See you next time. And now, guys, we've arrived safely in Canada, back at the condo. But one thing about our travels that I gotta say, while we're back at the Cancun airport, while you're here, just be sure that you bring your money. Because when we went to the Panda Express here, to buy only two spring rolls and this large bottle of water, it came out to cost not just $5 or even $10, but believe it or not, 15 bucks for what I had in my hands. But anyways, after arriving back to Toronto last night, we did our usual thing, visiting this place that we did not too long ago, and this time getting a little bit more value for our money, going for delicious late night Chinese food eats here at the perfect restaurant in Scarborough. But now, on to today, where the wife and I are already spending the whole day trying to plan our next possible trip. Before I go back to work, doing my first shift in over 10 days, doing a span of three shifts in the next four nights, I first got quick birthday shoutouts to a good friend of mine from back in university. This birthday shoutout goes out to you, Christabel. Happy birthday, Christabel. I also got a birthday shout out to my volleyball champion nephew, who you guys know has made several cameos in previous Live From Last Week videos. This birthday shout out goes out to you, Mackay. Happy birthday, Mexter. I'm hoping that all my friends and family members that have their birthdays today are doing well, staying safe and healthy at this time, and had a great celebration for your birthdays this year. So with a beautiful pre-shift sunset yesterday to the west that now sets at around quarter to five in the evening, I'm reminded about it now, looking off in the distance once again, after getting a decent post-shift nap in earlier today, and volunteering to go in for a night shift tonight that I wasn't supposed to work, since I heard that the unit was short-staffed. Now before I go in for work for a second in what is now a set of four night shifts, I have a quick birthday shout out to one of my childhood friends who I'm remembering going skateboarding with after school during our high school days. This birthday shout out goes out to you Clayton. Happy birthday Clay. We've also got a birthday greeting to one of my other childhood friends who would always represent us in high school on the soccer teams. This birthday shout out goes out to you Andrea. Happy birthday Andrea. And last but not least, we got a birthday greeting to one of my lifelong childhood buddies who you guys remember has made several cameos in previous Laugh From Last Week videos and who last year we celebrated in person their birthday with. This birthday shout out goes out to you Shaughnessy. Happy birthday Justin. I'm hoping that all my friends that have their birthdays today are doing well, staying safe and healthy at this time and had a great celebration for your birthdays this year.
Guys, after going into last night's night shift, where I went in, trying to help the short staff units out of the goodness of my heart, when I got to the hospital, I had somewhat of instant regret having to work with an assignment of seven patients. So on a night where I felt like I was just running around the whole time, wishing that I was back relaxing on the beaches of Cancun instead of stressing out at work, with many of our patients unable to sleep last night, it's no wonder I was able to take post night shift naps of over four hours in each of the past couple of days. But anyways guys, after a very eventful week, where I'm definitely missing the fun in the sun I had, looking forward to my days off once again, and going in for my third of my scheduled four night shifts tonight, we will just wrap up this week's episode right here. So, if you guys have enjoyed what you've been watching, feel free to follow Jaywalker POV on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube. Be sure to like and share this video, subscribe to the channel, and hit that notifications bell to be notified when new videos from Jaywalker POV come out. And once again, I'd like to thank you guys for watching. Stay safe and healthy out there, and we'll see you next time on Live from Last Week.